published 2.21 Eastern Standard Time, the 7th of March 2019, updated 2.25 Eastern Standard Time, the 7th of March 2019 Manchester United are renowned for their global fanbase and it came to the fore on Wednesday night. Ole Gunnar Solskjaer and his players managed a dramatic 3-2-1 win against Paris Saint-Germain at the Parc des Princes to become the first team to overcome a 2-0 home leg deficit in Champions League history. And around the globe, supporters of the Red Devils, which United claimed totaled 659 million people in 2013, went crazy in celebration of the huge victory. Scroll down for video footage of Manchester United supporters in Kenya going wild after their win over PSG supporters went out onto the streets to enjoy the dramatic victory against PSG more United fans near Kenyatta University in Nairobi walking together through the streets the group of United supporters singing Ole Gunnar Solskjaer's name as they celebrate footage emerged from the streets of Kenya showing United fans congregating on the road to celebrate the win. And a group of fans known as the United Diehards also stuck together after the win and walked through the streets near Kenyatta University in Nairobi to celebrate the game. It was not just in Kenya that fans went wild, though. Social media posts also showed French and English fans who had not managed to get a ticket to the game celebrating together in a bar in Paris. United supporters without tickets gathered in a bar in Paris to watch the match the tension was clear as they waited for Marcus Rashford to take his injury time penalty. But they all went wild when the ball hit the back of the net in the fourth minute of added time. Elsewhere, United fans in Mongolia had gathered in the early hours of the morning at a bar to watch their favorite team. Again, they all celebrated together when United confirmed their progression to the quarterfinal stage of the competition. There were also supporters watching in Mongolia in the early hours of the morning back on the African continent. Video also emerged of similar scenes in Nigeria, with fans seemingly celebrating in a storm. There was also brilliant footage from the away end on Wednesday night, with the players going over to celebrate with the fans. It seemed as though the likes of Scott McDominay were also singing Solskjaer's name as they celebrated with their supporters. Paul Pogba, who missed the game through suspension, went over to the traveling fans and shook hands with them after the final whistle too. Footage of the away end also shows United's players going over at full time to celebrate the supporters were clearly delighted by their team's 3-1 victory against Paris Saint-Germain. Paul Pogba went over after the game and celebrated with the United fans while suspended Solskjaer seemed confident that those fans will have more to celebrate over the course of the campaign. When asked whether they can win the Champions League, he answered, Of course, we fancy ourselves, we can go all the way but we just have to wait for the draw and take the game as it comes, we always believe, that's the thing. This is what we do. That's Man United. The belief in the boys was what we hoped for, 